Good morning, good evening, or whatever time it is for you, and welcome back to another video. Today we have celebrations from the last set. I recently bought these about two weeks ago. I haven't got to make a video because life, you know, life always hits you in a different place when you want to do something. You know, life, school, and work. But so far we got these. We're almost done with this set. I actually only have two more cards in the base set than the secret rares. But once I get those two cards, probably won't order any more. And we have another box too that will opening later today with the um, other stuff I have. And my now 10, it's going to be more celebrations than it will be this. Hopefully this will be the last box before I do open up anything else. But let's just get into this. So I'm wondering how has everyone been doing? I know I haven't made a video in the recent two days just because like I said, life has been happening and we have a kitty cat to help. It was sleeping, woke it up accidentally. Azumarill, Eevee, Mawile, actually using him in PvP. If anyone does PvP for Great League or not Ultra. It's just an Eldegoss, the first hit. And I believe once we get halfway through this, we'll open up the Dark Sylveon, which by far is my favorite evolution. And cat's fighting me on it. There you go. There you, go. you want the scissors? Get the scissors. Pikachu, Meowth, involved for Pandora. This and my load it. It's that. Hi kitty. Then we have Fabebe, Fall Form, Zumaro, Nice Lady, and the Castle. What's that? I start keeping my trash over here. And I believe once we open up the last two cards I need. I'll probably end up saving some packs to give away. I, I already have a pack saved. I need to bring it next time I meet up with someone. So we got this guy, this guy, Panchen, this, and a Flareon. First actual hit. We already have that, but that will go to a good home. And we got these. This guy, Voltor, Meryl, Weird Dude, and the evolved form of the little um, Mimic deal. Zora, Meowth, Feebas, this guy, and Swampert. Funny thing about this Pokemon right here, they for Zora, they actually showed a uh, the snow form slash normal form, a ghost in normal. It looks really cool. Y'all probably got Slugma, this guy, this guy, this guy, and a Sophion V Max. It's one of my favorite cards, like I said when I first pulled it. And I'll probably turn on the light because the lighting is a little bit weird in here today. We have Mantine, this, 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 and VMAX Umbreon. That's pretty cool. I would kind of laugh if we pull every single VMAX of every EV form just in this box. That'd be pretty cool. Then we got that dark soap going to open up, which we will get open, which we will open that very soon. This guy, Mawile. This Persian and my load it. I don't know where that cat went, but it decided not to help me anymore. No, I went over there to go sleep. So zoom around, Zora, Siwaddle, this and the snow deal. Yeah. 
Sandcastle, Eevee, Rotom, this, and Marshadow. We were almost halfway through this box, and then we'll open up the Eevee and the Dark Sylveon box, which cannot wait because it's my first time opening up celebrations because I do not open up cards unless it's on camera just because. This Pikachu, this, this, and Raichu ready to fight. And, um, to talk about the Diamond and Pearl remakes that are coming out, I really fought in the, um, what's it called? That this upcoming month for Pokemon Go, we would actually have Polky and Dialga come back up, but I was surprisingly wrong. It's this, Zora, Slugma, this, and this. And the whole reason I fought... Dialga and Pokey will come out is because, like I said, Diamond and Pearl remake come out next month. And I figured, hey, they're probably going to drop Dialga and Pokey again. And it kind of sucks if you got rid of all your stashes, because, not stashes, extra Pokemon, because there's a community day coming up for Shanks, which you'll get four times XL candy, or four times the chance of getting it. There's Pinsir. that? And I don't know how much we have left in this, but we're almost through with this box. Probably just end up finishing the box and heading into the Dark Sylveon. But yeah, I probably was a really educated guess to guess it was um, Pokey and Dialga next month, even though we just got the Shinies like two months ago. This Feebas love deal and this guy. What's that? Um, and I'm almost complete with this set. The last video was really uh and boring. I don't want to put out content that people will sit through and get bored because it's no fair to you, it's no fair to me. Slug, like this, this, Persian, and this guy. Yeah, my, my whole goal is eventually just um, put out content that I am proud of just because I don't want to put out content to put out content just because Want that should be quality you are sacrificing time in your day to actually view my video and watch it and hopefully liking it and subscribing but i don't think it's right if i put out a video that is a snooze fest or boring whatever you want to call it slash you know not worth your time watching it because then it doesn't make one make y'all want to come back for another video just because that video's quality was subpar Got this guy, Smeargle, my kit, this, and this. And I really hope I can pull the rest of these because I get kind of a little bit agitated from um, waiting for stuff to come in. And then sometimes I have a fear of them not coming. This guy, this, this, this. That is cool. A Glaceon Rainbow. That is really cool. I think this is the pull of the day, unless we pull a shiny meal, but that is a sir. And if we don't get those other two cards, we got a great pull right there. That Glaceon is amazing. I like how they do the rainbow stuff. We got Eevee, Marcargo, this guy. Levani and this and we only got a few more packs roughly one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten packs before we finally get to the main event Sylveon Dark Sylveon which was taken out by Team Rocket and then I actually got two more boxes I will open up today for um what's it called this and a Vaporeon. That's a cool Vaporeon. Probably one of the ones I'm missing. Um, no, it's not. It's not the one I'm missing. But it's a duplicate, so it'll go to someone. Feebas. This guy. Fall form. This and an Entei. But yeah, that's how I feel about my content. Like, if I don't make something that 
I don't feel 100% confident with, and if I don't take the time to edit it, it probably won't be released unless I release it saying bad content, just because I still made the video. And the hard thing about making content like this is once you open up a pack, um, well, you can technically um, put the cards back in and glue it back together, but I just think that's lying to yourself, and cards are basically like the lottery. And like Pokemon Go, you, you never know what you're going to pull from the pack. And which it is technically like the lottery, because you never know if you're going to win or lose. This guy, it's Miracle, this, this, and the Flareon. We pulled double of them today. And we're almost done with this. I really cannot wait to get to that, like I said, that Sylveon package back there, because my first time opening the um, celebrations. And I know there's a Charizard in there. There's Pokemon from previous generations, from the first set and everything. You know, Slugma, this, and this guy. And then, this, then there's one rare that's a shiny Mew. And I remember I came on release day weekend, actually, to buy those. And I just haven't had time to record just because work and everything. And try to continue to play Pokemon Go. But Pokemon Go, I legitimately enjoy rather than I subpar didn't like it that much these last few weeks just because the game feels draining. And sometimes making these videos, it feels really draining when you constantly do something and not get somewhere. Like, let's say if you go two to three months without getting a shiny or a hundo or something like that, um, it, it just becomes... Uh, it's the same thing with opening cards too. So if you get nothing, you kind of lose interest. Rotom, this, this, Marston, this guy. Like it, it just feels like, what are you doing it for? And personally, I, like I said, when I made this channel, I wanted to do this for fun and obviously to make someone smile. And the, me hitting puberty probably three to four times a year help definitely help people laugh or smile, but never know not sure if i need to edit that out but <laughs> i guess not so we got two packs left and we're going into that dark sophion this will probably be a, a not a 20 minute video i hope it won't be because if not i'm gonna have to speed it up through the hits for these because we've already seen me open up these and i really want to get to celebrations we got one more pack left for this box and then like i said we got another box for the next video and hopefully we get another two more cards i need and another rainbow rare that'd be pretty cool mantine meowth this this and the vaporeon i will actually probably give these away to either a subscriber or one of my boss's kids because they love pokemon even if they're korean i'm like hey i got korean cards for you he's like i don't care whatever cards or whatever cards i like them regardless i'm like that's a good man because I don't want to say beggars can't be choosers, but beggars can't be choosers. So. And it was between when I went to go get these. It was this, a Pikachu box, another Pikachu box, and a little thing. I want to get the Charizard, but I couldn't find it. But I'd rather get this than the Charizard, the Lance's Charizard, because... I like Sylveon, and I'd rather get something I like rather than get something what everyone wants to see. Because it's experience for all of us, but for me obviously opening and y'all obviously viewing. Just in case y'all ever want to buy something like this. I want to do it like this so we can get it out fully. Yeah. Just that. So you got this. I will put it on screen. So if y'all want to read it, then y'all can pause it if y'all want. Let me get that in focus. Just that. And then you, oh, you don't get the backside actually. So this is a mi misprint box. So the backsides, you will usually get the other side of it, which is Charizard. Then I have one of these. This is really cool. The big dark Sylveon. Put that right there with the Glaceon. And we actually got six packs, I believe. 
four celebrations and one battle styles and i believe vivid voltage just no darkness of blaze so the reason why they put some packs like this in is just because they're um it's gone they're they're oversized that means they made too many that they didn't sell them all so they put them in boxes like this so they can get rid of the accents and out they have And hopefully I can get that crap out good. There's Dark Sylveon. I will definitely make a book for these because I like them. And they cost a pretty decent amount of money. There's the code for anyone who wants it. And like I said, we got four celebrations. Hopefully one has a great hit. If not, we did still get this from the box. So regardless, it's a winner. So let's start with these first. First time opening up these because I never really got into Pokemon. I would always complicate. I'm oh, not complicate. I would always faint about hey. I remember always going to um. There's a code for anyone who wants it. I would always faint whenever I was trying to start YouTube. Dark or fire. So. I would always think about the little kids that would have to go open up stuff or go buy stuff whenever the pandemic was happening and Pokemon cards blew up. And I would always think, hey, I remember opening up these cards. I want the same 10 year old, nine year old, six year old to have that. Because Pokemon means a lot to me. And I dragon, that's pretty cool. See, that's pretty cool, I'll keep those over there. It's battle styles. Because Pokemon really does mean a lot. And whenever I open up the big box, I will actually tell this very significant meaning behind Pokemon to me. And why I will probably always love it, even when I get older and older. Because I did do a stint where I was not involved in Pokemon. Because it just kind of grew out of it. And i really don't want that to happen again because it really does mean a lot to me so here's the code card for battle styles one two three four let's do grass and so water core is focus Brugly, honch girl shinx which is getting community day this month or november this ponyard timber tub pig Bruno, which is from the Elite Four, and Victory Bell. So now we finally get into these, and I'll probably go slower for these, because these are, um, what's it called? I'm just gonna open it like this, so we don't spend all day trying to open it and struggle. So I don't believe there's a card trick. I believe there is, but I personally do not care. So we have the code card for anyone. We have Lugia, Cosmum, and these are all holographic. Groudon, and then we got the original Pikachu, which that is really cool. It's one of the ones I wanted to pull just because it's Pikachu. It's, it's the mascot, obviously. You could tell by the 25th right there. It is the mascot of the Pokemon. So I'm gonna put that with that. And, and these actually are and also they're not that cheap but they're not that expensive if you buy them singly online they're like 10 bucks a pack that's why i say go to target buy the pack i buy and it's 19 bucks you get four so it's five bucks per pack if you want to stay rather than spend 10 bucks for one but ho ho xerneas you have vettel and the flying pikachu now if we get surfing Pikachu pack what people want you to pay i don't think that's right now uh, granted, the stuff you can pull, you can sell for a lot more money, but it shouldn't be about to sell them. You should want to um, just do it because you like doing it rather than, oh, hey, I'm going to make an investment, sell it. Well, it's your money, so do what you want with it, but I just want kids to be able to open it whenever they can. So this, anyone wants it, Cosmom, Xerneas, Kyogre. Another Pikachu. So this one is very common, so I'll probably give one or two away. 
All right, how many I pull, I'll give away just because. We got one more pack. And again, thank you for watching the video. It really means a lot. Um, I hope to pull more stuff from this. And like I said, be a little bit more excited. Because I was really happy about the, um, the, the, not the gold, the rainbow card we pulled just because I've never pulled a rainbow card before. So there's this. There's Sekrum, Cosmom, Charizard, oh my god, base set Charizard, one of the cards I wanted to pull, this is an amazing card, like, never, ever pulled a base set Charizard, I probably started in Neo, but this card, oh my god, this, this made the video, this practically made the video, besides the rainbow card, that is so cool, then we have the Mew, but, you cannot upset this guy. This guy is amazing. I still cannot believe I pulled him. <laughs> well, thank you so much for viewing. I need to go get a sleeve for this and the little bitty gold card. Not gold card. The rainbow card I pulled. But oh my god. <laughs>